Hey everybody, welcome back to my 7 Days to Die series, Surviving Alpha 18. Uh, it is the morning of day 7, and today would normally be Horde day, but like I said, we're not doing Horde in this series until day 30. Uh, it's kind of what I like. I mean, I like, uh, you know, um, playing around, doing some building, exploring, all that kind of stuff first, and then we'll have a big Horde night. So that's my goal. Anyway, um, got the helmet light working. Uh, what we're going to do, I think, today is a couple things. If you notice on my toolbar there, all of the uh, weapons I have down there are um, have all their durability missing. And what has basically happened is we've been a couple of updates since I last recorded. So we're going to have to go ahead and um, make a bunch of repair kits to solve this problem. Um, and I would just finish. I just finished watching a Glock 9 video. He's he spawned in a bunch of re repair kits to repair, and I think that's completely fair. But we've got tons of resources. We're not doing Horde Night either, um, so I don't mind actually just making them and using up my resources to fix that. Uh, it's a fun pimp thing, but what do you do, right? All right, let's get these things repaired. All right, it's going to take a little while for those to turn into repair kits. Let's get. Um, <clears throat> It's been a week since I recorded, so I have to kind of figure out where I was at here. So let's make some more glue. We have, we do. Uh, let's make seven. So I need 49. 49. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, let's make some more glue here. Uh, glue. Gluten-free glue. Uh, let's get one, two in there. It's plenty. Let's get that going. Excellent. All right, we got four repair kits now, so let's keep repairing stuff here. One, two, and the fire axe. Three. Man, it's gonna take a while. We got. We need what? Three more. Which is exactly what we have. Three more repair kits. Excellent. So we want to get our weapons and stuff back in the, in the toolbar. I think I can leave some stuff behind. Here. Let's repair this and repair and our knife. Repair, excellent. Uh, we should probably make a couple more repair kits before we go, even though I don't think we are going to absolutely need them. Why do I have forged iron in here? I don't know. Uh, let's go with a couple of these, and let's repair. Oh, right. Uh, we need two duct tape, and we need two more. Here we go. So I was thinking about thinking we were going to be going to the trader today. Um, let's get two more repair kits. Pull the knife out of there. Um, we'll head up to the trader today. I did a lot of work, I believe, uh, between episodes of last night downstairs. Um, and let's put, uh, let's put the hammer in here because we don't need that right now. Uh, the wrench can go here. Let's bring our shovel down. Uh, wait, we need our pistol here. Bring the bike down. Actually, you know what? Let's go, um, let's wear this for today. Because we want to go, I think I'll ride my bike over. We're going to go hit up the, uh, radio store, I think, um, today. I was thinking about, um, going to the trader. We might do that later on. Depends on what we get in the radio store. So I did a bunch of upgrading in here, as you can see. Um, yeah, I'm stuck again. I don't know why it does this crazy okay so uh, a lot of cobblestone upgrade I pulled the wall out that was here all the metal that was here is gone this is all upgraded to concrete this is concrete for the roof concrete across here uh, just in case they knock out the walls down here or whatever or this comes down this is all supported from above here um, so that's all done we'll make it reinforced concrete at some point and like I said if we were gonna run the horde tonight we would just knock these out put some bars in and we would easily be able to handle the horde without a problem uh, so we're going to make our way out of here. I didn't do much on this side, um, although I'm planning on doing that. I want to raise it up one. Uh, but we have to take all this stuff out of here, and it's a lot of work. So I just worked on the other side for now. Because, um, I mean, we would take the horde on in here, I think. They'd come in. They may hit the other rooms, but we'd be up here, and we'd be on uh, cobblestone platforms and just dropping shit down on them. So let's get out of here. Actually, we can't get out. Oh, yeah, no, we can't get out the front door anymore. We have to drop down from the roof. So let's go do that. So yeah, it was a little bit of work last night, but not much. All right, so let's get on our bicycle and head over to the radio store. All right, here we go. 
And let's just pick this sucker up for now. Put it in our inventory. Now, we're probably going to need to bring it back down again, but we'll just do that for now. And I don't know where they want us to start in here. We cleared out the trailer there the other day. Uh, what do we got here? Nothing on this thing. I don't think they want to have us go over from the trailer. I should have had to look to see if there's any resources we're lacking. We can go in that window there. That's an elevator shaft. Okay. What do we got? Another window we can go in. I'm gonna leave the helmet light on for now. Might turn it off a little while into the into this building here. Okay, we got an unlocked door. So check that first, I guess, eh? Still got my prim primitive vast bow. Somebody was uh, mentioning about that. Actually, I'm going to turn the light off for now, I think. Somebody had a fire in here. Looks like we're clear on this floor. Let's go up and have a look at what we got up here. Huh. Pretty darn quiet. He says before he gets attacked brutally by a thousand zombies. Yeah, I'm hearing somebody upstairs now. Yep, hearing them dropping. Come on. Somebody's got sandals on. Oh, where'd you come from? He's having a hard time getting up here too. Here, hold this for me, will you? I shouldn't be wasting arrows, but they seem to be sticking in them just fine. Looks like he's holding on to all of them so far. You chose the wrong side, dude. You should be going up the other side. I think one of them broke. How many did we get back here? Oh, all the way down, huh? Damn you. We got seven back. I think that was all of them. Yeah, so as I was saying, I, I, I um, during the week I kind of play a different, uh, different um, series than this one. Uh, so I've got another uh, Alpha 18 series going. Well, not series, but um, playthrough that I just do for fun uh, in my spare time. And uh, I managed to buy a baseball bat at the uh, Trader of all things. And oh my god, does that thing hit like a truck. It does twice as much damage as the regular bat. It's crazy. So if I can see a, bat, a baseball bat at the Traders, I'm definitely buying it. And I guess I should have had breakfast before we left, eh? Uh, let's uh, use this. And we'll use this. Okay, I'm going to grab this stuff. Well, as we see here, I am busy, apparently. You are busy. Busy killing zombies. Uh, yeah, we got to get up there somehow. Got a feeling that we're supposed to go up this way. But, nothing that we can't fix. We're going to get all the trashes and stuff when we come back down. Ooh, can't get up there, eh? There we go. Um, so is there just one zombie in here? Uh, what's that up there? That looks cool. This would be kind of a cool building. I mean, I've noticed there's several POIs in this game now that are like really, really simple um, buildings that you could just like 
you know, easily just move into and take over uh, and just build from the ground up. Like this is one of those ones where there's, you wouldn't have to clear too much, right? And then you could make, it's like pretty much solid brick exterior. Like you could turn this into a base without a problem. There's a barn kind of like this one too. Uh, that looks like it's nothing over there. Take the pills though. There's steroids. Ooh, weapons bag, nice. Ooh, I'll take that. Um, you'd think there would have been a bird up here, but not that early in the game. They should have put a dead body up here, making it look like the guy was trying to uh, radio to get away, but just never happened. Um, let's put the structural brace in the Iron Reinforced Club. Just to get it out of the inventory here. Put that one there. Bring this guy back down. Alright, well. I mean, we could wrench all this stuff apart or break it apart, but it's just going to eat up some of our time today. So let's go down and finish looting this place. Take an inventory, maybe drop the stuff back home. Maybe we go hit up the uh, trader today, see if he's got any inter interesting jobs for us. Grab the frame, grab that. All right, I'm going to loot this place, and I'll see you guys out front. All right, so we got almost to the bottom, and then all of a sudden we ran out of space here. So I'm going to do a couple things here. So we picked up improved fittings mod schematic, which we'll use, which is nice. The Huntsman... Uh, vernal vultures are typically encountered in the desert and attracted by wounded dying prey do 10% more damage to vultures okay that's kind of cool nail some chicks which i think we've already got used so let's hang on to that let's use this sucker get a little bit more food into us and we'll drop down here and see what else we got i don't think there's much else here some lockers ah toque yes i'm from canada so it's called toque uh so let's take those. I think that's it. I don't think we're going to be able to carry anymore anyway. That's nothing in there. What's in here? Eh, we want the rotten meat. We don't really need the glass though. So let's take these two. We need the rotten meat for the farm plots. So as much as we can get, we'll take. And anything here? Yeah, a little bit more pizza, whatever it is moldy bread all right that's it well that was thoroughly disappointing unfortunately but we did pick up some half decent stuff so let's go drop this back home and then let's hit up the trader and see if we can get a uh, a quest for today all right i should have put a ladder up here you know really should have uh there's our frame let's make a couple more i think i used all my frames last night when i was working on the on the base so uh actually let's put this there so yeah i just forgot to replace them okay so let's just drop this stuff off skull cap cowboy hat i think we're going to sell this one we're keeping one so let's do yeah see all this is like no endurance at all let's just throw stuff in here for now okay i think i'm just going to sell that uh nail some chicks quest because the chance of us finding like getting a nail gun and finding uh, chickens. It's going to be a pretty uh, pretty daunting task indeed. So we'll just leave that for now. We'll just sell it. Uh, what else do we have here? Do we have anything we can sell? I mean, I, these are going to be wait, like no sell price now unless we fix them. Okay, let's sell these two though. So uh, modify. Let's take the dies out. I'm going to need a, a storage bin just for all the dies. Take those two. Tank top, I don't think we're going to need. Uh, let's just leave the rest for now. Yeah, I don't think you can make um, the mining helmets using football helmets anymore. Because I tried to uh, find the recipe for this. So if we do, uh, like there's no recipes with these. Right? And then if we take the flashlight and do recipes, we just got mo like, like flashlight mods, right? So I don't know if we can really use, like, let's get rid of these two. So I don't really know. Um, shades, we're we going to use the shades. I don't think so. So let's sell those. Ah, man, all this stuff. Like the junk turret's fine. 
but the AK is not. So I don't know what they did here. Steel knuckles. So we should, I'm not going to use melee, hand melee. It's only worth 30, but it's still better than nothing. So let's take that. All right, let's go sell this stuff. Um, where is the trader again? Right over there. So now let's head over there uh, and see if he's got any quests for us to do. Hopefully, I mean, maybe he's got something in town that we could uh, do like a clear zombies or something. Huh. Dump in long coal mining. That's where we're going to have to go check that place out. I think that probably, that door probably leads way down to the ground. Oh, we'll check that out soon enough. All right, here we are. Let's see what he's got for us today. Let's see what they've got for us today, that is. Greetings, All right, Jen, Spanier. what's up? I've got the best deals in Navis game. Do you? You don't want to buy that, huh? All right, well, let's see what you got for me here. Um, don't want the repair kits, thanks. Stock on day 10, huh? So we got a new set of inventory. Like I said, it's been a week since Thank I played, you, so what do I got? Check back soon. I get new clothing wise. Daily. Regular overalls, four and four, so we need better pants. Got BDU top. Oh shit, my armor's all. I gotta repair this too. And my helmet. Dang. Pardon my French there, guys. Um, gothic pants, 450. I hate spending money. BDUs are great because they're so cheap. And there's the airdrop. What's the chance of it having BDUs, do you think? Scope, 8 times mod. Ooh, that's nice. Hunter mod, armor place, armor pierce, or armor plating mod. Uh, what else do we got? Uh, steel spear schematic. Wooden bow. Thank you. We'll take you. Bow crossbow parts, huh? Just one. Yeah, so the amount that it takes to actually make higher level stuff, kind of, the, it gets incrementally, uh, more costly the more uh, um, the higher level stuff gets which I think is a great Safe idea travels. yeah thanks let's just scrap this and um, do we already have this one we'll just accept it uh, but let's get it out of our wow I haven't done any of these all right no worries let's get it out of our um, active and let's see what jobs you've got available clear zombies to the west. This is the other thing they've added to where they tells you the direction. 1.9 kilometers northwest. That's way past our, our house. South there's southwest. Ah, really? Well, we've got the bike now. I mean, that's southwest. I could really use some help, friend. Old West Business 13. Oh, All right. Well, I will make it's going it to take us a while well. to get there, but we're going to go do this one. All right, guys. I'll see you when I get there because it's going to be a long, bumpy ride. All right, guys. We kind of got here, but then there's this weird kind of feature here. Um, I don't have no idea what this is. It's supposed to be plowed fields, maybe? I have no idea. It's like all the way around this POI, pretty much. I have no idea. That is so bizarre. You know, I think they were still working on terrain gen, but damn. That is something weird. All right, uh, we better drink something here. All right, well, Swigan's Serum. Guess we're going in here. And my guess is this is like a kind of medical store or something. It's 
find out. I should probably have the gun out just in case, but so we're clearing zombies in here, right? Eh? Got to be careful because we don't have. Oh, thought we'd have to run there. Don't have uh, any armor. Okay. I'll call that basement clear. Yeah, so the trip here was like bizarre. I'll show you the map in a second. Okay, we got that guy. Let's pull him. Yeah, this bow's like much straighter. How you heard me, I have no idea. Okay, he's done. She's running. Come on, girl, bring it. Oh, shoot. Well, compensate for my lack of aim with a good club shot to the head. I think that's probably it for down here. Okay, we're gonna loot after. Let's go upstairs. I'm gonna start out with the spear though. The bow is nice for pulling, but I don't want to waste arrows this early. I mean, I know it's day seven, but okay, that's unlocked. Let's take this door over here first. That looks like it goes outside. Oh, it's Mo. When is it not Mo? Hey, big mama. Yeah, they got a... Oh, shoot, that was a miss. Whoa, stuck on the wall. They got to work on this, being able to retrieve the spears. Whoa, no stamina. She's angry. I don't blame you. Is that it? Okay, we got her. Like, to be, like throwing and then retrieving the spear right afterwards is a little bit ridiculous. Okay, we got somebody upstairs. Nothing. Toilet. Oh, okay. Well, you're going to take this one in the face. Oh, that floor gave out just at the second I killed her. Well, well, well. Oh, nice. What do we got here? 100 Volume 7. Don't become prey using these tips to stop would-be attackers. Do 10% more damage to humans. Well, we got to use it because... Uh, can we get down on here? Oh, we can. Um... Because we got to try and complete the series for those. All right, there's some stuff we can use. It's a good thing we didn't need to use our armor on this one. We should be able to get back to the trader in time, I think. Ooh, two acid, nice. Uh, yeah, let's go back down this way. Check the toilet. Three, nice. Okay, nothing in there. Um. Let's take this bed apart for the springs. All right, what do we got down here? I think we're gonna take apart the, uh, let's take this too. Um, let's take apart the, um, the still downstairs, whether it's working or not. Because the only time we're gonna be back here is if um, we get another uh, quest to come here. So, and if we do, it'll just, it'll reset it anyway. Okay. Ooh, what have we got in the cupboard? Nothing. Yeah, a little bit there. I know I could take the landers apart, but 
at this point. What's the point? Cotton. Looks like we got some ammunition in the corner there, too. So I'm going to take a little different route back than I took to get here. Because it looks like there's another city right next to ours. Or town. Okay, take that. Uh, let's put you here. Bring the bike down. I don't think... Oh, there's a couple of other things here. What do we got here? Steroids. Why am I finding just steroids everywhere I go? Uh, backpack. Yeah, good enough. Let's go. Oh, wait. Uh, nah, there's a chance of nothing behind there. Not going to waste my time. All right. So we're going to hit the road up and go back. I'll show you the map here in a second. So let's pull... Not so encumbered. Um, having a look at the map real quick. So I kind of rode the road up here and then turned off and went across country. This is all hills. So we're going to go back down the road because I think it goes through a town here. And we're going to see what's there. And if we can't make it back to the trader today, that's fine. We can do it tomorrow. But I think we got enough time. We got five hours before nightfall. So it only took a couple of hours to get here. So here's the road, and this should take us straight into that town. I'm going to forego stopping at these cars and stuff. All right, I'll see you when I get to the town. So here we go, just a little bit south of where we were. Uh, gets us into another town. So there's a building here we can grab some supplies from. I don't know if we need to hit that one up right away, but definitely when we get a uh, um, cement mixer going and stuff, we can hit that place up because there's tons of cement in there. Is this, uh, no, I thought this was Bob's Boar's Carl's Corn, but it's not. Apartment building. Another apartment building or ostrich hotel. Some houses, so it's not so bad. I mean, I thought I saw a factory building here, but maybe I was just seeing the, uh, the um, apartments. That road goes off down there. That's a big church. Now, what's this place over here? A lot. Oh, that's a popping pill. No, working stiff tools. Okay, that's a good possibility. Earl's, Earl's place. Uh, military camp. Looks like there's some other stuff down there, but we're just going to hit the road and we're going to head this uh, road straight back to our place because this goes straight through our town. I should check to see where that airdrop ended up. Maybe it's close by here. Oh, it's just by the trader. Okay, well. Hello. Goodbye. What's that there? Thought it was a trader there for a second, but it's not. It's just another military camp. And we're just passing by our start location here. So the box should just be up here, I think, on the top of the hill. We're pretty darn close to the trader. We just passed him. This is kind of a cool road because it... it uh, Pretty much if we stay on it, it leads right back to our house. And uh, riding along this road, there's plenty of uh, dead animal carcasses along the way. So I'm thinking that I may have to do an episode where all I do is, well, not necessarily an episode, but um, take a day where I just kind of go around and gather up stuff. Yeah, we've got a beaker. Nice. Um, that looks like a, I thought that was a shotgun messiah, but it's not, I don't think. All right, let's get back to the trader, cash this quest in, and get home. All right, here we go. Let's see what he's got for us. You know, I don't remember if we got any beakers or not. It's been, like I said, it's been a week since I recorded, so I can't remember if we have any beakers at home. Not that they've got a beaker for us anyway, but let's take the lever, level, level two leather gloves. Um, because we've got the spears already. And our gloves are out of um, um, health here, so we're going to take this. Let's complete that. And then let's wear these. One last thing we have to fix. We can scrap this. Get a little bit of leather for that. Uh, I think we're going to melt the leg armor, so we're not going to sell it. Uh, let's use this. And you know what? Um, what do the gothic pants give us? Are they 
Oh, way more heat resistant. So let's buy these. Safe travel. I wish we could just do that right there. Um, yeah. Okay, let's get home. Okay, we just read the zombie dogs challenge just to get it out of our inventory. Let's put these in here. And let's get rolling. We've got two hours. We should be fine, I think. I'm kind of realizing that this road here kind of goes right to our house. So I'm just going to ride over here and take the road back. But you can see like all the car animal carcasses here. There's like a ton on this road. So we're going to have to just spend a day hitting those up, I think. All right, we'll see you at the house. All right, here we go. Prowling Pete's. Well, let's get our ass back up on the roof here. I'm going to go up this way, I think. Yeah, let's get our bike up. Nice. If we can actually get up here. Ooh. All right. Uh, we can just take this out of here. And that there. Excellent. All right, let's get our stuff put away. I think we're going to call the episode here. Oh, blueberries are growing nicely. And so is our mushroom spore. All right, let's put this stuff away. Actually, we're going to put the... Where are they here? Two sets of leg armor that we found today. And I think that's 250. Yeah, 230. Good enough. Set those to go. We'll melt those up, get them in the forge. Let's put our, the other stuff in here. All right, that should do it. Looks like that was our first beaker. So we've only got one. I dropped it in here for now. Um, well, it's a good start anyway. Compared to my last, or my first series that I did, we never... <laughs> We didn't find a beaker to like the A32 and we found two of them or something like that. It was ridiculous. So yeah, we can make our own chem, sta chem station soon enough. Uh, but I'm going to end the episode there, guys, I think. Um, sorry, it wasn't a bit more exciting. What I think what we'll do tomorrow is um, I'm going to spend probably the first half of the day tomorrow collecting resources. We're going to need a lot of wood and I want to make a lot of wooden spikes to get around the walls here. Um, so we're going to do that, um, collect some resources. Then we're going to go hit up another building somewhere. Uh, maybe we'll go back over to one of the buildings over there. Um, or you know what? We'll go down and we'll check out that coal mine. I think that's what we'll do tomorrow. Uh, we'll hit that coal mine up down there just to see what that's all about. Um, seems like an interesting building. All right. So I'll end the episode there. hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.